Is this the last resting place of kidnap victim Muriel Mackay, remote Jaywick Sands on the Essex coast? 53 years ago, Mrs Mackay was held for ransom by two brothers. They were later jailed for her murder. She was never seen again. It's now emerged that one of the brothers, Arthur Hussain, claimed he buried her on Jaywick Sands. His solicitor revealed the killer's confession in a letter to the appeal court in 1972. He said he told local police. But author Simon Farker, who discovered the letter hidden in legal documents, doubts anyone followed up the information. As far as I can tell, no police officer was ever given this information. Um, there was no visit to see Arthur in prison, either by the police or by that solicitor. This is the only piece of paper amongst thousands of pieces of paper which actually name a possible burial place. Mrs Mackay was the wife of newspaper executive Alec Mackay. She was abducted from their London home just after Christmas in 1969. Her kidnappers mistook her for Anna, the then wife of Rupert Murdoch, Mr Mackay's boss. Earlier this year, police reopened the case and searched the Hertfordshire farm where the Hussain brothers kept Mrs Mackay prisoner. They found no trace of her. I learned to live with it a long time ago, the loss of my mother and the way it happened, so I don't really want to go on and on forever. But if someone's willing to have a quick look, or a proper look, for us on this huge area, maybe that's a good idea. There's no evidence that any police have ever searched here for Muriel Mackay, and certainly her family were never told of the solicitor's letter, nor, it seems, were detectives on the case. And today, Scotland Yard is reluctant to start a new search. The officer now in charge of the case has dismissed the claim as one single strand of intelligence. With the killer and his solicitor dead, he said he can't validate the information. Martin Brunt, Sky News, Essex.